Once upon heaps of ages ago, in legendary Polynesia, there lived the most beautiful god of them all. And his name was Tangaloa. Uh, hey, Mr. Sound Effect guy, do you think you can add some really cool echo effect? Like Tangaloa, Loa, Loa, that kind of thing? Okay, ready? <clears throat> and his name was Tangaloa. Nice, I like that one. Okay, where was I? Now, it's not like I ever met the guy or anything, but when I try to imagine what the greatest god of them all look like, I picture the rock. Now, picture the rock as a god. Now, times their strength by like a million, and then add like a hundred million gazillion muscle on him, and boom, pull it. That's Zagaloa! Amazing strength, isn't it? One day, Zagaloa was on his balcony in the heavens and he looked down to see how Earth was doing. Cause this was way back before Jurassic Park and the dinosaur and stuff. Anyway, he was shocked when he couldn't even see the Earth's surface. So he called for two of his servants. Truly. Present, my lord. Fue. Go see what the haps is down there. Those trees are out of control. Fue. I need you to cover all bases when you get there. Tuli, make sure everything runs smoothly. And for the love of me, no more incident reports. Sweet as, boss. So, Fue makes its way to Earth and completely covers the trees with its vines and smothers them. Meanwhile, Tangaloa sees what's happening. OMG, G being me, that's not what I meant by cover all bases, Fue. So, Tangaloa goes out to another servant. Noi! You caught my lord. Have you seen what's been going on down there? Leave it to me. <laughs> Get it, boss? Because Fue has leaves. Leave it to me. Hmm, <laughs> stink one. Don't you worry, boss. What I have planned will blow you away. <laughs> Get it? Because I'm the wind and I'm... Holding everyone up. Now get on with it. But just then, something kind of gross happened. Fue completely transformed from his vine-like form into a sea of millions of maggots. Eee, gross. I'm a bird and should be enjoying this, but I've totes lost my appetite. Hey, I've got an idea. Um, what on Tangaloa's earth are you doing? Tuli, relax. Have some bird seed made and watch this creative spirit's magic. Wow, that looks choice. It would be really cool if my name was included and whatever you plan on calling that. The back of the head shall be called Zuliulu. As Ngaoi got the hang of molding this new invention using the slippery ass maggots, he then formed what looked like a human stomach. My name should be mentioned there too, bud. This should be called the Tuli Manava, Tuli Lima, Tuli Vai. And what Ngaoi created that day was a human. Someone who could take care of the earth so those guys wouldn't have to keep popping up and down from the heavens. And it's with these names that we are reminded that Tuli is the medium between Tangaloa in the heavens and his creations on the earth. So guys, that's it. That's how we were made. Which means if you ever come across maggots, no, you're going to be vine. Get it? Because those maggots were from Fue and Fue was a vine. <laughs> Stink one.